What up y'all, welcome back to the channel. My name is Dominic and I appreciate you being here. And today I wanna to talk about something a little bit uncomfortable, something real, something authentic, and something that I think we all need to hear. Bring this vlog to you guys in an effort to inspire, to encourage, and to, it's almost hard to even start this vlog because I don't know the right wording. I recently started talking to a mental health professional. It's the first time in my life I've ever reached out for any type of assistance or help um, in regards to mental health. And I remember talking to some friends and some family about it and some people that were really close to me. And, I, and the immediate reaction was very negative. It was like, I always thought you were uh, really grounded, Dom, and you always seem so happy and you always seem so positive and you're you're seeing someone like wh what's wrong like what's going on like I don't know I don't know how to explain it it was a very bad feeling um, the reaction that I got and I think that it's a very common reaction as I did talk to some other people that had seen mental health uh, and got mental health um, they said that it was very similar reaction and I, I was kind of disgusted by it I was almost like you know why are we judging each other for growing and trying to improve ourselves. Like what's the difference between seeing a mental health professional and a doctor to help you with your mental and emotional state and a doctor that's helping you with a, an infection or a broken bone or you know any other physical ailment that nobody would judge you for. They would commend you for uh, you know going to a doctor and being proactive. I was taken aback by it and I was kind of turned off by the fact that you know, these are people that are really close to me that care about me and that I care about. They looked at me like as if something was wrong and kind of triggered me and it triggered me to think about how many other people are feeling like. And I'm a very confident, I'm a very open person. I have no problems talking to people. I can converse with anyone. And so for someone like me that felt that right away, um, I can only imagine what it'd be like for someone who is much more private and has much more of an issue talking to people and the shame, that embarrassment that, that, that they would. What I want this vlog to really say is really shame on the people that are judging others for trying to be better and for getting help and for uh, seeking out someone to aid them and to encourage them and to get better. I think those are the people that are the brave ones, that are the strong ones. And if you are seeking mental help or you're thinking about seeking mental help, I encourage you to do so, whether it's a minor issue or something that's been lingering for years and years that is festering and growing, uh, absolutely go find someone to talk to. Don't let money stop you. Don't let others judge you. Um, you know, don't let family or someone else prevent you from situationally going out to do that. I think you are brave, you are strong. For me, when I did reach out and I did find someone, as I went through the process, I started unpacking and realizing that I, I did have issues that I didn't even know I had. And I did have, you know, problems that, you know, needed to be unpacked. And I would have never even known that had I not reached out and talked to someone. And I think it's kind of an ignorance thing. Like, you know, none of us realize that we have issues until we realize we have issues. And you will never know unless you take that step to grow and to change and to improve yourself. And so, and I actually think the ones that judge others are the ones that are just scared, that are fearful to go out and to try something new, to seek help, to admit that they have an issue or to admit that they need help. I think that's a very scary thing for a lot of people to do. And there's nothing wrong with asking for help. And I think especially as males and young males, uh, a lot of us, you don't ask for help, whether it's for directions, whether it's for instructions, we're just stupid. And I think it's time for us all to stop as men. I encourage you men to put your barriers down, put your egos aside and reach out for help if you need it. In 2021, we all need help. And you know, we've had an insane year. We're going through an insane time right now. The amount of depression and anxiety and stress is at an all time high for so many people. So why not slow down? take a breath, get some help, get every tool that you can to help you feel better. And that's what it's all about. It's being happy, enjoying life, finding peace, finding comfort. And I think mental help is a tool that we all can use to get there. So uh, I'm opening up and being vulnerable today in telling you guys this and sharing this experience with you. I hope that you guys embrace this, look at yourselves and really turn a corner if you are someone that is judging others or even joking about it. It's not funny, like it's not funny to bring someone down for trying to be better and trying to get help. So uh, this vlog is not to be negative, it's actually to encourage um, I hope to inspire and I hope to break down some barriers that maybe some of you are f feeling and, and uh, facing in your life. I reached out to um, BetterHelp. It's an online 
mental health team um, and they have like all these counselors and therapists and psychiatrists and and things and, and you know um, I could go into a whole review video on that and how that experience was. It was it was strange, <laughs> um, but I have nothing to really compare it to. I'm just kind of exploring the world of mental health and kind of getting into it because you know, like every other um, idiot out there, I was always I'm fine. I don't I don't need anything. I'm good. Like I'm a positive person, and I've never really felt depression. I've never suffered from anxiety. Um, I've had a pretty easy life, and I've had pretty low stress, but. Um, I think as an adult and as you pile on, you really um, don't realize the issues that you have. I think until you start unpacking things and uncovering things and peeling off the surface, you know, I think we all have issues. I think we all have um, stressors and problems and traumas in our lives that we could probably improve on. Um, and a lot of things for me, I didn't know that I was dealing with. And I'm sure there are people that are having much more uh, suffering from much more issues than I am, but I do realize that I, I could use help and it is nice to talk to someone. It is nice to uncover tools that I didn't know were there and things that, you know, oh, this is great to help change my mindset and help change my focus and all these different things that if you don't know, you're just ignorant to the fact that if you don't know, you don't know. And, and until you reach out and find a professional to help you, that's when you can really open doors and um, break down barriers and start improving. All of us can just be better and grow. So if this video can just encourage one person um, to A, stop being judgmental to someone that is trying to better themselves or another person to take that first step to embrace yourself and embrace change. The whole point of this vlog is to put your mental health first. That's what I'm encouraging you to do today. Physically, mentally, emotionally, be healthy. Um, prioritize yourself. Get your mental state correct. Get your emotional state correct. Find peace. Find happiness. Because really, in the end of our lives, that's all that matters. And that's what I'm telling you guys to do today. And I'm encouraging you um, to be brave. Put yourself first. Prioritize yourself first over everything else. Financially, your relationships, um, everything will improve if you improve. And that's what I'm kind of... Uh, hoping that this video does for you today. So with that, I appreciate you for listening to this ramble. I hope this helped someone. Um, if it did, drop me a line below. I'd love to hear from you. All right, y'all. I'll talk to you in the next one. Peace.